Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando and I do all like home decor videos, everything to do with like shopping hauls, home goods, Target. So if you love videos like that, definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. I am joined today with my bodyguard, best friend, and boyfriend, Brian. Hello. <laughs> Delayed reaction. And we are at the Dollar Tree. I'm really excited. I've gotten so many requests to shop at the Dollar Tree. We don't have one really that close to us and I just always forget about it and people are like, please show the Dollar Tree, go to the Dollar Tree. So if you have ever requested it or been interested in me doing a Dollar Tree video, this video is for you. But I'm really excited to see all the seasonal stuff they have. Dollar Tree is so cool because everything is literally a dollar. And sometimes I'll post something and people be like, you can get something just like that at the Dollar Tree. So I'm really curious to see what they have. So I won't blab on too much. I will say, hang on, I do wanna say that my 10,000 subscriber giveaway is still going for one more day. It ends tomorrow on Friday, so if you're watching this like the day it comes out, you still have a little bit of time. If you are watching this before February 5th at 11.59 p.m., you can still head over to the video I'll link down below to enter my 10,000 subscriber giveaway if you are interested. But that's all I wanted to say about that. Good luck to everybody. The giveaway closes really soon, and I'm super excited to pick the winners. But let's head into Dollar Tree and see everything they have. So before we even get into the store, they do have these really pretty flowers. Like I said, everything here is a dollar and they have like a lot of varieties. These would be really cute in like the little bud vases. They have a bunch of different colors too, pink, white, blue, purple. They do have some little like greenery ones. Oh, that's actually so cute. It has like the lavender hanging off of it. And this is all only a dollar. We are off to a great start. I actually really, really like that. They have a white version too. Okay, I'm actually gonna take that one with me. They have tons of Valentine's Day stuff, Valentine's Day like packaging, Valentine's Day cutie little things, and then Easter too. Oh yay, like tons of little like glass vase filler that is like glittery and really cute. Little felt craft kits, painting kits, all that sorts of stuff. Cute little chick felt craft kits, golden eggs, egg platters and everything is a dollar. A lot of this Valentine's Day stuff would be really cute if you wanted to do a Valentine's Day tree. I have someone that is subscribed and we talk on Instagram and she did a really, really cute Valentine's Day tree and all of this stuff would be really fun for it. Little foam heart stickers. They also have a lot of cute little like heart picks. All this stuff is so cute. I'm pumped to see the decorative paper shred because I've been looking for this at Target and if I can get it here, for just a dollar, that's honestly such a great deal. This is something that I wanted to do for the giveaway boxes, so if you win the giveaway, you might see the making of some of your prizes. They have really, really cute gift bags and stuff too. Little like treat bags, they have so many different gift bags and stuff. They also have some bows and these really cute like doorknob hanger. I can't believe all of this stuff is just a dollar. Like they sell stuff just like this at Target for way more. They have some like outdoor signs. This one's cute too. It'd be cute for like a little boy's room. It says love you to the moon and back. Then they have these like felt hearts that you could actually use as like table placemats. This one could definitely be personalized if you have like a cricket or if you have like great handwriting. They also have this one. It says like happy Valentine's Day, a little like door placard wreath. This little red truck one that says happy Valentine's Day. There's another one up there that says love each moment. I can't reach it because there's all these boxes, but that one's really cute. This one says follow your heart. And then they have those placemats in pink and red. I love those. More little like outdoor or door decor. This one's really, really pretty. All different like pink, magenta, light pink, red, very Valentine's. That could also be a cool like table charger. If you put like a plate on top of it, that would be really, really nice. They have this little like teddy bear one that says love. This red one that says love. This is like a heart with an arrow through it. Oh, this is cute. It's like two adjoining hearts and then two red adjoining hearts as well. They do have table covers, 
this one that says be mine this one that is just covered in hearts and then this red truck with heart one for valentine's day they also have like tons and tons of candy so different like valentines as well as different candy treats and they do have like name brand stuff they have like trolley blow pop nerds all different kinds of candy so i would definitely check here <gasps> tootsie rolls am i the only person that absolutely loves tootsie rolls i like the chocolate ones i like the fruity ones let me know down below my favorite sour patch kids bunnies these little sour patch kid bunnies and then yeah minis oh no but these are um these are conversation hearts, they're not Sour Patch Kids. Oh, that would wait. be a perfect single serve box. My two favorites are right next to each other. I'm definitely a fruity candy person, and he is a chocolate candy person. Oh, I'm at all the chocolate. <laughs> yeah, I'm a fruity candy person for sure. Definitely let me know what you guys are. But these are my two favorites. If I had to choose Starburst, it's definitely my favorite candy ever. The pink color is the best, and then the orange one is really good too. They have these baskets. They come in two packs, and they have them in red as well as pink. Those are nice. Could be really nice for like kids' organization as far as like um, distance learning if they're at home. Then they have this bowl, which is nice. It's like a heart-shaped plastic bowl. If you were having like a little party or something or wanted to give your kids a snack, it's pretty big, so it'd be good for like chips and then dip on the side, which would be really, really nice and one of my favorite snacks. They have these little pails as well that say, follow your heart, and then that one says, keep its corner. So really fun ways to like have things that are functional but still themed. If you are looking for Valentine's on a budget, they have a lot of really cute options here, different like sloth themed, Minnie Mouse, there is Paw Patrol, Hello Kitty. So they do have some different like character ones, Disney princesses, 48 Valentines for a dollar. It's a really good deal. So if you are looking for some Valentines, you need a bunch and you wanna save some money, come here. They also have a lot of spring stuff. So this is all like gardening stuff. So like gardening gloves, little gardening accessory wind chimes, that sort of thing. 3D wreath form. You could do a lot of cool stuff with that. Just so many different, oh, a sprinkler accessory? Oh, so you put it on the top and then your sprinkler looks like a frog, that's so cute. But then they have just a lot of like different seeds if you're interested in like starting your own garden and then just like little pots and some other fake flowers. Other stuff for spring are little garden accessories. So they have these like little stones that you stick into your garden. They have a couple different designs of those. Then they have one that you can hang, but you could also just put it in the garden too. But it does have the holes specifically to be hung. And they have a couple different designs of that. And then I think these are like plant pots. So you'd put the planter in it and it catches the water. So that's just like a little dish for that. More spring pots. All of them are plastic. Some of them are thicker plastic, but I will say a lot of them are very thin. They do have a lot of colors and also you could spray paint them and make them look a little bit more expensive, but they do have a lot of different colors and sizes. And they also do have some metal ones as well, but not too many varieties of that. They do have this one as well that has like little burlap string wrapped around it, but I definitely wouldn't say it's a great selection of pots. They have a lot of garden hooks for like hanging potted plants, more stones, this little cute gnome, just a lot of like stuff to help you with gardening as well like tools scissors wire cutters ropes for like tomato plants that sort of thing found some fake limes they actually look like pretty good you get three of them for a dollar this is a cool find i wish they had some lemons too but honestly we buy a lot of lemons and limes so we don't really need to have fake ones more garden accessories more gloves lots of like garden decorations they also have some really cute easter ones let's go for an egg hunt that like welcome windmill one which is very like farmhouse they have a cool llama one which i like some butterfly ones a frog Lots of different styles for these. I really like this little bunny sign in general. This is cool too. They have a bunch of these. Oh, I thought the flowers were attached. So just these like plain little wreaths. I thought that the flowers were attached for some reason because they kind of look like they are on those top two ones, but they are not attached. But you could easily attach stuff to that to make it like more decorative. They have some like pink vases in there and then just tons more fake flowers. Some of it looks really, really good and some of it you can definitely tell is 
super fake looking but some of it there are definitely some hidden gems in here i love the ones that drape down like so that one for instance like cascades down and is so perfect for like a hanging basket and then i really like these ones too that look like the um, bald flowers they have it in like yellow pink and i grabbed a white one so there's definitely some good hidden gems up in these okay moving on to st patrick's day decor they have some really really cute options a lot of stuff at all the stores looks so similar so i'm gonna recommend that you actually come here to the dollar tree for anything like this because it's only a dollar and it's definitely a lot more expensive at hobby lobby and especially joann's so they have these like really cute like cascading three shamrocks little like door shamrock and then these um like table things you like you know you put them on a table and they just make it look a little bit more decorative these are a really good find they are led string lights 10 lights and they're little shamrocks those are really cool i wonder if they are more green when you turn the light on because they look more honestly yellow than anything but these are a great find and they have a bunch of them they do have these little leprechauns that you could put on your door and then a couple different signs. They have like a plain little shamrock. They have this one that says Happy St. Patrick's Day. Another one that says Lucky and Blessed. And then they have these signs that are like a bunch of different things. This is a great find. This one says Welcome and it has a little like galvanized accent. Only a dollar. This one says lucky. Those are some really good finds. I feel very lucky to have found them. More table accents. This little leprechaun hat, I really like that. And then some little leprechaun hats. A couple different varieties that say, this one says like full of shenanigans, that's Brian. This one has four leaf clovers. That one's more like traditional. More St. Patrick's Day little signs. These are the same as like the Valentine's Day one. You could use this as a placemat. It's pretty big though, so I feel like unless you had a really big table, it might not work, but maybe just in the middle of a table with like a little plant. This one is nice too. It's more like 3D almost. It's not flat like this. It has some thickness to it. For whatever reason, they have table tennis balls right here as well as some St. Patrick's Day socks. They have this little shamrock crown. This is nice for like a Hobby Lobby shelf if you wanna put like a birdhouse on top of it, you just put this right at the bottom. And if you wanna do St. Patrick's Day for that, I would recommend grabbing one of those. It's just really easy to accent with little stuff like this. They do have some greenery here. All of this has these little coins in it. They have a couple different colors like darker and lighter, more white ones, that sort of thing. These are also really cute for a Hobby Lobby shelf. These little um, pots of gold, you could put like M&Ms in them. You could pick out yellow Skittles and put it in them or whatever kind of candy that you want. Maybe some gold coins and that would look really fun on a Hobby Lobby shelf. They have a bunch of scarves and bandanas that are St. Patrick's Day themed or colored. Some of them are definitely a little bit more obvious than other ones, but they do have a bunch of those. They have, oh, okay, perfect. So they actually sell coins that you could put into those little pots for your Hobby Lobby shelf or whatever area you want to decorate. And they're fun, they say stuff on them, four leaf clover for good luck. Those are really cute. Those would be perfect for inside of these little pots. They do have St. Patrick's themed window clings and little craft items, little foam cauldrons foam four leaf clovers so that would be fun for a little like st patrick's themed craft and they do have other st patrick's apparel items so they have like this beaded tie for whoever wants to wear a beaded tie a sequin bow tie and then little like headbands say happy st patrick's day just all different stuff boas this one's really funny it says irish and it has like a pot of gold with a rainbow so just a bunch of stuff or if you want to be the queen of st patrick's day they have that they just have a lot of little things. They also have these little St. Patrick's themed signs. I haven't seen anything like this at any of the other stores, so this is a good find as well. This one says leprechauns welcome. This one says Irish wishes and shamrock kisses. A truckload of luck. That's really, really cute. Oh my gosh, I like that one a lot. I feel like these are so great, especially for a little shelf or a tiered tray or whatever. And I haven't seen anything like that at any of the other stores I've shopped at. You have some stuff here for Mardi Gras as well. Not a lot, but some. They have some like colored hats. They have a boa. They do have some sashes. I don't know what they say. I don't think it says. Okay, well, it doesn't say what they say. Does it say like let the good times roll maybe? And then another one here that says happy Mardi Gras. 
Those are so fun. I've never celebrated Mardi Gras, but about to. yeah, but I date someone who loves to celebrate Mardi Gras, so I'm really excited. And then they have these like little beads and stuff, these photo props. Oh, those are fun. All these photo props for just a dollar. They also have like masks, mini colored hats, this really crazy hairband, a crown. They have some really fun stuff for Mardi Gras. Ray Dunn, is that you? No, I'm just kidding, but it looks just like Ray Dunn. That made me laugh. They have tons of different shaped vases. Tall ones, skinny ones, short ones, stout ones. Seriously, all different shapes. And you know what you can do with these? You can mix baking soda with any type of acrylic paint that you want to, and you sit there and paint it, and it actually comes out looking like a terracotta vase. That's a really good idea, super easy like DIY that you can do and you can make a dollar pot plus like a dollar for the paint and you probably already have baking soda. Look like anything that you want and look a lot more expensive. I did find more Easter stuff on this back end cap. So they have, oh these are funny um, to get and like put it on the floor and see how your dogs react. You basically like twist the little thing and it like hops towards you. So they have little bunnies, they have a chick. They have this like clip on little bunny tail. That's really fun. And then more like door decor. So they have this egg. They also have this bunny, a little chicky tic-tac-toe game, some other little games like paddle games, gel stickers. This one's cute, this little door hanger, a smaller version of that. And then some crafting things. So a foam shaper it comes with all the things you need to make that little bunny or they have color your own. And then they do have some little baskets as well. So just like a hint of Easter stuff so far. Back here they have a couple Easter door hangers. They have a purple one and a blue one with just little glittery jingle bells at the bottom but it is shaped like an egg and they come in pretty pastel colors. I've showed wine glasses in some of my last videos, my last few videos, and someone said that they actually have really nice glassware here. I have not tried it. If you have tried their glassware or their wine glasses, leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. Oh, these margarita glasses are kind of nice. Oh my gosh, that's heavy. That's a nice margarita glass. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I know, it's super heavy duty. I see like martini glasses, margarita glasses, a beer mug. They have a lot of different glasses here. Let me know what you guys think of them down below. We found this cute little like oil holder has a little tiny cork at the top this is adorable i also really like these little mason jar salt and pepper shakers i had a set and eddie broke the salt one so we only have the pepper so they will still be mismatched because we're just going to get one of these but it'll be a lot more similar than what we're doing right now wanted to show you guys all this contact paper that they have this stuff can be really really cool because you can actually use contact paper they have a lot more options on amazon as well to like redo your countertops that probably sounds crazy but they have ones that look like marble and granite and stuff and if you have like laminate countertops or if you don't like the granite in your house you can buy the contact paper that looks like marble and you can watch like a youtube video that will show you like how to lay it down i've seen people do it like on bathroom counters or whatever and it looks amazing it's crazy how much it can change the whole space so they do have some contact paper here but they also have a lot more on Amazon too. Over in like the organization section now, they have a ton of different like baskets and stuff. These ones, these gold ones are really catching my eye. It's honestly like kind of crazy how similar this looks to the one that I showed in my Joanne Fabrics video. And this one's only a dollar and I'm pretty sure that one was like $30. These gold baskets are awesome. You could use these to organize your pantry and it would look super super expensive but it will have only cost you like maybe ten dollars checking out some of like towels home stuff okay our new pots and pans came with these they're pot and pan protectors literally i was gonna throw them away because i had no idea what they were and i had never seen them am i the only one because now they have them here at the store and i just think it's kind of ironic how i had never even known what they were and then our pans came with them so now of course i use them because i want to protect our new pots and pans but do you guys use these tons of like basics over here in the towels they do have some like funny ones that one says like forks to be reckoned with love cooking but it's mostly just like basics so like grays blues really neutral colors um, but they do have some like cuter ones as well 
bless this kitchen love is a four-legged word which is true love builds a happy home so they do have some more like styled ones as well and everything is just a really good price i will say this is a great place to come and get some of these like kitchen basics a splatter screen you really don't need anything more fancy than this we have a couple splatter screens i really like them because it helps not make like a huge mess also this cheese grater is really awesome for only a dollar they do have some pots and pans i imagine you might want to spend a little bit more on pots and pans they kind of get ruined like if they're not non-stick they have some cool other stuff too a chopper scraper scissors cake decorating kit it's apple corer as well as like spatulas spoons all that sort of stuff like just all the basics these ones are actually Betty Crocker brand all of these are Betty Crocker brand I don't know I would come here just to get stuff like this like if you're looking for just a lot of basic stuff you can get it here for like super cheap as opposed to spending like three times as much at Target okay another thing I wanted to say is this is a really good place to come and buy these little like tins sometimes we cook in these these ones even look really nice they're like black with gold on the inside but they have literally i'm backing up so you can see all the different sizes they have and these are ridiculously expensive at publix and walmart and they literally have every single size you could ever need and a lot of them are like decorative even and they have the lids and all of these are a dollar so if you need an aluminum pan for literally anything, I would come and get it here for sure, wouldn't you? He was actually the one that pointed it out. He's like, oh my gosh, these are so much more expensive when we buy them at Publix. It doesn't make sense how much they are. It really doesn't because you literally throw it away. But yeah, I would come here if you need like a reusable foil pan for sure. Like this exact roaster pan, I think we spent, no joke, like six to eight dollars on this. At Walmart okay just got done in the Dollar Tree and I just wanted to quickly show you what we got where you got some candy <laughs> so I'm gonna just show you whatever what is this okay Brian went on like a chocolate spree I spent $15 or $16 or I think I spent like 15 something so I got 15 items apparently we got this solid milk chocolate heart that I didn't realize slipped through and then how many bags of these did we get two so, okay, so we found these. Okay, I don't know if you guys have ever had these. These are like the original Snickers. Mm -hmm. They are Goldberg's Peanut Chews. Normally you can only find them at Wawa, like here. But we found these mini ones at the Dollar Tree. So this will be a reason for us to come back to the Dollar Tree. We love these. And when we were staying downtown at Brian's old house, we would go and get Peanut Chews all the time. Um, because there was a Wawa right by his house. But we don't have a Wawa by us anymore. So we're really pumped to have found these. If you have ever had these, definitely let us know but they're really good and I can't wait to eat one when I'm done filming this video. We got a couple bags of those and then we also got a bag of Reese's Minis. We went off, okay? I don't know what else to say about it. Okay, and then I also wanna say that they had a ton of seasonal decor, but I didn't see a lot of like regular home decor. Like they have like some basket, like organizational baskets, that sort of thing, but I didn't see any regular home decor. Um, besides for like all the seasonal stuff. So I just wanted to throw that out there. That's why it wasn't in the video. But I did get a lot of Valentine's Day stuff. It's all for the giveaway winners to go in the giveaway box. I wanted to put little Valentine's Day stuff. Originally, I had an order pickup set um, that I was going to place for Target. But I was able to find everything here for way cheaper. So that's a win-win. I got these little, like, decorative table scatter hearts. A couple different, like, varieties of that to just throw in the boxes. Can I have a bite? Oh. <laughs> it's so good. You don't even like milk chocolate. I like it like that. I like it like that. I like it like... You want another bite? Mm -mm. You sure? Mm -hmm. Cool. I got six bags of decorative shred. I got two bags of red, two bags of white, and two bags of pink, which we found at the very last second, which I was super pumped about. So yeah, two bags of red, two bags of white, and two bags... It makes me think of that, like, is it Elton John? He's like, bottle of red, bottle of white. Mm. You don't know that song? Okay. And then I also got this like little fake plant that I showed you guys in the very beginning of the video. And then the only other thing I got was pink tissue paper. So I would definitely say go to Dollar Tree if you're looking for like seasonal decor. They have really cute stuff that's extremely comparable to like Hobby Lobby and even Joann's and stuff. But for literally a dollar. So I would definitely say go there. They also have really good like 
um, gift bag supplies, so like gift bags, tissue papers, little like wrapping, decorative shreds, bows, bags, that sort of thing. They have an awesome selection. So if you're like me and you haven't really checked out Dollar Tree too much, I would definitely recommend it for those things. They also had like a ton of glassware, a ton of cleaning supplies. It was honestly like a really good experience. In this video, I mostly just wanted to show you like the decorative decor and stuff like that. But if you want to see a more in-depth Dollar Tree video, what they have for like food, art supplies, school supplies, because they have a lot of different stuff, definitely let me know down below. I am so sorry. I've definitely asked you guys to comment like 50 different things down below I just like talking to you guys in the comments. Okay, I respond to all my comments But i'm sorry that i've asked you to say so many different things down below But yes, if you want a more in-depth video, definitely just let me know I just wanted to keep this video a little bit shorter I like my videos to be longer, but sometimes it's nice for everybody when the videos are just a little bit shorter But yeah, that is everything I picked up on this trip to the dollar tree. Alrighty, you guys Well, that is gonna be it for me today. I really hope that you love seeing everything that was at the dollar tree I was so surprised by all the cute stuff they have. I will definitely be making more trips over here in the future like I said in the beginning we don't have one like super close to us so it's definitely like got to go out of my way to go to that store but it's definitely worth it when everything is a dollar and they have really cute and trendy stuff so if you love seeing this video and everything that they had at the Dollar Tree definitely make sure to give it a big thumbs up make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you next time bye guys